This dumpy, ill-maintained flat was filthy. The furniture was dirty, worn out and cheap, bed linens were stained and possibly unlaundered and the rubbish hadn't backslashed been taken out since the previous occupant. We did not get any welcome letter in advance with instructions where to get keys. We have to call upon a rival to host, and he direct us by phone to locker, their keys were kept. Street noise in the apartments, literally there is no sound isolation at all. I liked one of my hosts and he was really nice to me and helped me when I needed assistance. There was two different apartments having a party and the main host Brian kept saying we all had to leave he was rude and very intimidating threatening to kick me out at 2am with nowhere to go. This accommodation is okay for one, two or three nights because there isn't backslashed a cleaning service. You are given one bath towel per person and no hand towels, you have to manage with that. Wash and use. The problem is that when you wash the towels and linen there isn't backslashed another Kitchen to replace. Kitchen was very basic. We stay in lots of apartments and you usually get sugar slash tea slash milk etc but there was none here. There wasn't even a toaster or bottle opener. There were blinds missing and lots of light bulbs blown. The facilities are very poor. This is an apartment so it should have everyday items to make it an apartment. It had no microwave. It had no toaster. No mirrors in the bedroom backslashes. It had only one cup. Contacted the owner said he would bring more cups. They never came. <laughs>